The wait might finally be over if Samsung just dropped a big hint about the One UI 8 stable update for smartphones. Samsung has started rolling out the stable One UI 8 watch update for its smartwatches today, and that's a strong sign that the One UI 8 stable version for phones might be arriving soon. The update has first landed on the Galaxy Watch Ultra and Samsung confirmed it will soon expand to the Watch 7 and other eligible models. While this is great news for Galaxy Watch users, it also points to a bigger update coming for Galaxy phones. Samsung has been testing One UI 8 for smartphones through its beta program, which began in late May for the Galaxy S25 series. Since then, new beta builds have been rolling out regularly, bringing performance improvements and bug fixes. Now that the watch is getting a stable version, can the smartphone update be far behind? If you're planning to buy the Galaxy Z Fold 7, make sure to use the exclusive links below made just for Cybotech viewers to grab some awesome perks. You'll get free $50 Samsung credit just by clicking the link, plus up to $150 storage upgrade credit, which means you can either double your storage for free or get a big discount on the One TP model. On top of that, get up to $1,000 in trade-in credit for your old Samsung phone and 30% off Galaxy watches and buds. These are limited time offers, so don't miss out. One UI 8 brings several upgrades over One UI 7, including smoother animations, cleaner UI changes, and faster performance. Samsung has also added more personalization options to make the phone feel more tailored to you. Still, the fact that the stable phone version hasn't launched yet shows that development is still ongoing. Earlier this month, the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Flip 7 became the first devices to ship with One UI 8 pre-installed. Samsung is now fast-tracking One UI 8 for its budget phones. The company has been testing this major update on several older Galaxy devices and now the process is picking up pace. A test version of One UI 8 has just appeared for the Galaxy M35 5G. This test build, M356BX-U5CYG6, was spotted for the Indian variant of the phone and confirms that Samsung has begun internal testing. This is big news, because Samsung usually starts with its premium models, but now budget phones are getting early attention too. I hope you liked the video. If you enjoyed the video, subscribing to the channel would be greatly appreciated. That's it for today. What's your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comments section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.